Hey guys, it's Amanda here, and I have my son. And what's your name? Jason. Jason. And we have a real, you can kind of see it. We have a really neat product that we're going to show you guys. Um, we just got it, didn't we? Mm -hmm. So we want to talk about it just a little bit, and then someone's going to take it. So we're going to hurry up and do the video so he can play with it. But we got the brand new Wonder Crew. Uh, there's four different ones, and this one is Superhero Wheel. So there is a um, a darker skinned superhero. There is a I, don't, I guess you would call it like a medium skinned superhero, and then there is a um, brunette and a blonde light skinned yeah. superhero. Um, yeah. I'm trying to be as politically correct there as possible. <laughs> so there you go, and you guys can see my lovely model here in the background that I use for some of my crafts. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and open now you can tell on the box he is pretty good size um he is i want to say he's the 18 inch i think that's right but it comes with a mask and cape for the kids to be able to wear which is pretty awesome so they get to look like each other and yep includes matching cape and mask for the child so we're going to open it and go ahead and get into it aren't we yeah yeah so here we go um, it is taped on the top, which makes it, okay, he's not used to being in the videos, can you tell? He just keeps waving at you. I literally just got it, so, um, I said, oh, we can go ahead and do a video real quick and show, you know, how it is when you first get it, and he was willing to let me do that, so, because mm -hmm. I dropped the scissors. It is taped on three sides of the top for you parents who wanted to know how much tape and stuff is used. You don't have to worry about it accidentally flying open because that ain't going to happen. So here we go. There is that part. And we're going to slide him on out. Now he does not have real hair. He's got like some plastic style hair. That's it. So it's in that box. And then here he is. And you can tell he's got his cute little mask he's going to get to wear. On the back, for you parents who want to know how difficult this is to take apart, you've just got the um, tie strap uh, with the plastic thingies. So you've got three plastic thingies, and then it's just taped where the plastic's like holding his head in and stuff. So not really that big of a deal. I've seen worse. Um, this is probably the nicer packaging that I have seen, so that part I really like. If we can get it open. Well, that one just completely made our little superhero crash down. Hold on, I got two more, and these are holding us feet in. Parents, if you don't have scissors, use nail clippers. That's what I do. But I had scissors. I went ahead and removed. So here he is. Here is Superhero Will. Now he has a plush body, so he is, he is squeezy here, and he's got hard arms. So he, um, I'll show you what he looks like. Here's his superhero mask, and it is on him with a, just like a rubber band. Super easy to take off. Reminds you of those loom band things. Or you know what, if you just get tired and don't want to try to undo it all, yeah, just get your pair of scissors and cut it off. Don't you? Yeah. So here is Superhero Will's mask. And I see he's got plastic hair. It doesn't come off. So this would be a good superhero for any age group. You don't have to worry about there being something for him to chew on. You know, somebody else chew on. Um, if you're worried about them chewing on something and getting hurt, I, I wouldn't give them the mask. You know. Uh, here he is with his mask on. Isn't he cool? He's so cool. So he does have the cape. The cape also comes off. So here's his cute little cape, and it's made, it's actually made with pretty good quality, in case you're wondering. Um, it is, so it's lined, it's not like it's um, badly stitched by any means, it's actually very nicely done there. I really like that, how... Even you, his shirt can come off. Is, even his shirt can come off, so it's made to come off very easily got the velcro on the back which allows children to easily take it on and off so that's awesome you just got the velcro on the back that goes all the way down 
And your pants can come off. And his pants can come off. So we're going to go ahead and show you what he looks like. Underneath. Here's his little pants. And here he is. So underneath, it looks kind of like he's wearing long johns. I'm Superhero Will! And I'm naked. <laughs> so, of course, he is plush. Anywhere you see the white. And if you see the skin color, he's hard. So, there you go. The pants do not have a tag in the back. However, they are, to me, they're cut differently, but maybe they're not. I think it's going to be hard to tell which one's the front, which one's the back. Um, so it, it might be versatile. He doesn't really have, well, he's got quite a booty on him. So probably if you put the pants on backwards, you're going to know about it. I do like the detail that they've included in this superhero. Oh, and his for those of you who are cautious, um, you can't really see it, but his butt has the beads in it. Um, it's not just the soft cushion cotton plush. His butt does have those, um, reminds you like what's in a beanie baby kind of thing. Um, I'm assuming that's to help give him some weight. So I did not know that. There you go, in case you kind of wondered there. So, we're going to get him back dressed again because poor superhero Will does not like to be naked. I wouldn't want to just be naked while somebody's trying to video me for something. Would you? He's pretty cool though. superhero though, isn't he? Yeah. I like him. Here's some other details you might like. He does have, look, he's got the little creases on his feet and his toes. Here's his toes, if you can see them. He does have the little creases on them. And he does on his hands as well. So there's actually a lot of detail that went into the superhero. Now the cool part. Dun, 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 dun. Um, the mask and cape are just with the, the plastic stuff. So this is how it looks. And let's see if Jason will show off our cool mask. Here is what the mask looks like. Pretty simple done. It is lined. This is a satin it looks like. And then it's just surged around. Let's see if he will demonstrate. Now we have superhero Jason. Look at the. Oops, sorry, baby. Let's fix that. Oops, sorry. You fixed yourself. The cape. I got a tickle. The cape looks just like superhero wheels. Um, it also is satin. Or a form of that. I'm going to go with that. Okay, I'll put it on. And it is also very nicely sewn. I like that. It's not top stitched around, but I, I really think the way that it is sewn since it's flipped back and it's not just surged or something like that. They've, they've taken a lot of time and effort into the way that they've sewn this and they've given it extra support right here, which is where they'll, you put this on a kid, that's the first thing I want to do is try to jerk it to open it instead of using the Velcro like you should. And so it says Wonder Crew on the back. So now he gets to be just as cool as his super hero action guy. So now he looks at, look, get in, the, get in the camera here so they can see. Look. Oh, we can maybe fix your eye here. <laughs> Aren't they cute? So we'll put a link below on where you can get yours. Currently, I believe they are at Target and Toys R Us. We got ours at Target, so I know he is super happy that he has a little dude now. So we're going to say bye, and we hope you enjoyed the video. If you liked our little video and you want to see more stuff, give us a thumbs up. You can comment below with random things that I probably got wrong in it, or maybe things I got right and you really liked. If you want to see cool other cool things that we do, make sure you hit subscribe. And we'll also put a link so you can be able to buy your own Wonder Crew guy. Thanks!